morning, I'm Lauren, and today is Tuesday, April 4th. In today's news, April is Autism Acceptance Month, and the district is celebrating by selling t-shirts and hoodies. Orders are due no later than today. You can access it by scanning the QR code that will be printed on posters throughout the school. Today for lunch, we're having grilled cheese, tomato soup, and green beans. That's all for now. Thanks, and have a great day. In today's sports, we have boys varsity tennis versus Everett away at four. Boys and girls varsity track versus Central Cambria away at four. Boys JV baseball versus Chestnut Ridge away at 4.30. Girls junior high volleyball versus Conwell Township away at 4.15. Thank you. Have a great day. Run three. Run one. Uh, I would have to say my favorite unblocked game is probably Slope. I don't even care. <laughs> Kroger.io. Don't move. Can't expect that much from me. Uh, tunnel Rush. Is it? Uh, uh, uh. It's been rolling. Oh, uh, my favorite's 2048. Uh, my favorite is Cat Ninja. Alright, thank you. Everybody. Uh, I, I like Cookie Clicker. The original. I am the goat at Cookie Clicker. The original. <laughs> In recent world news, a Chinese spy balloon that flew across the United States border was able to gather intelligence from several sensitive American military sites, despite the Biden administration's efforts from blocking it to do so. China was able to take many pictures by controlling the balloon so that it would make multiple passes over the sites. New York City police have put up metal barriers and dump trucks around Trump Tower and blocked roads near Manhattan Criminal Courthouse as they braced for potential protests ahead of Donald Trump's expected surrender to prosecutors on Tuesday. The former president is due to be arraigned in the courthouse later Tuesday afternoon. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.